Marco, the popular teacher in Highlands Ranch, had to return to his native Kenya after his visa expired. Well, now after just an incredible series of events, Anthony's visa has been renewed and he's back at work in Colorado and telling a story to Denver 7's Tom Mustin. I was super surprised. Super, super surprised. Anthony Wanjiru fought through jet lag to dish out hugs at Valor Christian High School. It's a miracle. To be honest with you, it's a miracle. Anthony returned to the U.S. on Sunday after a miraculous chain of events allowed him to return to his adopted home of Colorado. Things moved so quickly that I didn't couldn't believe it. During his eight years in America, Anthony volunteered with youth groups and at the rescue mission and was a popular IT instructor at Valor. Last month, his visa expired. Valor students started a viral movement called Anthony's Visa to keep him in the U.S. to no avail. After our stories ran, he reluctantly returned to his home in Kenya, somewhat of a celebrity. The story had, had gone viral and people in Kenya knew what was going on. While back in Kenya, Anthony organized a food drive to feed his starving villagers. Literally starving kids, you could see their, I mean, their rib cage. Despite approval from the U.S. Immigration's office, Anthony's lawyer told him returning to the U.S. was a long shot and not to get his hopes up. Last week, he met with a woman at the U.S. Embassy in Nairobi. He told her his story. Well, they approved my visa without any questions. What did you think when she said okay? Yeah, when she said okay, I was like, that's it? You're like, yeah. <laughs> and that was it. After a canceled flight and 24 hours of travel, he looked out the window of his plane near DIA on Sunday and burst into tears. The mountain is always a sign, I'm home. Valor offered him his job back, and that led to this emotional reunion on Monday. Every place has a lifeline, and Anthony is the lifeline here. Students made up cards to welcome Anthony home. Everybody loves Anthony. Anthony's <laughs> Anthony. I was very excited because like, he's like family to us. And as Anthony rejoices in his return to Colorado, He's convinced he owes his good fortune to a higher power. For me to be here, I would say his prayers answered. Anthony's visa has been approved for three years now, but he says, as we've seen lately, nothing is certain. So he's now beginning the year-long process of getting a green card to allow him to stay here permanently. It costs about twelve thousand dollars, though. So he says he's saving every penny now to make sure that happens. Well, what a story! Love that. Yeah. Yeah, also very great. appreciative of Denver Seven and all the folks he says who've helped him along the way. So, so. many people have come forward. Welcome yes. back, Anthony. Yes. Very nice. Very nice. Thanks, Tom.